this video shows some of the detail in uh, our Vallecitos, New Mexico homesteads uh, straw bale house where straw bales were cut uh, six inches in for the six by six posts and um, all alternating where we'd have two um, straw bales underneath one up here and then half straw bales on each end um, the straw bales were impaled with rebar this rebar was actually set down into the uh, foundation um, corona the top eight inches had rebar in it and this was cement but below that was uh, cobble um, round river rock uh, with uh, perforated rock to allow moisture out this perforated pipe I mean was um, inclined down so that it would see daylight out but outside the house um, the, the uh, yard cloth was placed around that to keep particles of sand, etc., from getting into the perforated pipe. Um, eight inches was a code height for this uh, uh, crown of cement on top of the cobble trench foundation. This had to be 18 inches wide to, for the straw bales. The rebar was spaced for center of each straw bale. So each straw bale would be impaled to the foundation on the bottom, but then the other ones would simply be driven in from above to keep the vertical until uh, the walls could be stuccoed. Cement on the outside, of course, to keep the moisture out, and adobe on the inside to allow for it to breathe. Here's some. Um, what we did uh, at the bottom of the straw bales, we had flattened folds of uh, tar paper. I should say flattened folds of tar paper. Three folds with uh, 20 mule team borax and insect deterrent inside, uh, inside there. I think deterrent has two R's, right? So these are some... Um, ideas uh, that I wanted to share. Of course the beauty of the gravel trench foundation or the cobble is that water can move right through it um, without damming up and freezing and damaging foundations the way cement ones do. And uh, in our home we saved four thousand dollars by going with uh, uh, rock instead of cement wonderful for our carbon imprint also and the fact that we use straw bale was uh, inexpensive and our heating system was a uh, five tons of adobe floor which is dirt cheap